Good everyone, you're watching Rate You Fixes. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix in case if you're not able to open NVIDIA control panel in your Windows machine. Now, the first step, what I would suggest you to do is I would suggest you to go ahead and kill the NVIDIA services which are running on your computer. To do this, uh, what you can do is you can do a right click on the start button and click on task manager to open the task manager window. Once you have the task manager window open, now under this section, you may go ahead and click on details. Under the details, on the right hand side, go ahead and look for NVIDIA services. You may go ahead and do a right click and click on end task. In case if there are any multiple uh, services for NVIDIA display container, do a right click and click on end task. Once it is done, Close the task manager and then try to open the NVIDIA control panel and see if you are able to open. In case if you are able to open, you don't need to try the next step. Now as a next step, uh, what I would suggest you to do is, I would go ahead and suggest you to uh, start the NVIDIA utility services from the services.msc window. To do this, uh, what you will have to do is, you will have to do a right click on the start button. Once your once you do a right click on the start button, you may go ahead and click on run. In the run window, go ahead and type services.msc to open the services window. Once you have the services window open, locate for NVIDIA LS services, so NVIDIA display container LS services. You may go ahead and do a right click and click on properties make sure the startup type has been set to automatic in case if it has been set to manual make sure it has been set to automatic in case if these options are grayed out and you're not able to uh, start these services what you can do is you can stop the services once you click on stop then you should be able to change the startup type from manual to automatic so once you stop you will see this option set to automatic and restart the services click on apply and then click on ok follow the same step for nvidia local system container you may do a right click then click on properties under the startup type make sure it has been set to automatic in case if the option has been grayed out stop the service change the startup type and start the service apply and then click on ok close the services window once you close the services window you may go ahead and restart the computer and then try to launch NVIDIA control panel and see if it is working. In case if it is working, well and good, you don't have to try the next step. Now as a next step, what I would suggest you to do is I would suggest you to go ahead and update the NVIDIA display driver. To update the NVIDIA display driver, what you can do is you can do a right click on the start button and then click on device manager to open the device manager. In case if you get a user access control prompt, you may click on yes or continue on the screen. Under the device manager, you will have to locate for display adapters and you will see NVIDIA graphic card right under this section. So what you will have to do is you will have to update the driver for NVIDIA graphic card. To update the graphic card, you will have to do a right click on the NVIDIA and then click on update driver. Under this, you will see two options, search automatically for drivers and browse my computer for drivers. So choose the first option which says search automatically for drivers and it will take you to this window. Now, if you see the option which says search for the updated drivers on Windows Update, choose this option and check if there are any NVIDIA drivers through the Windows Update. In case if there are any update, you uh, or if there are any windows update go ahead and install the windows update and uh, restart your computer once you restart your computer then you can try to launch nvidia control panel and you should be able to open nvidia control panel in your windows machine so in spite of trying all this step and if you are still facing a problem or uh, what i would suggest you to do is i would suggest you to leave me a comment in the comment section so that i can come up with the possible solution I hope this video was useful. In case if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a great day.